park and the Dalles Dam Visitor Center, directly across from the Dalles Lock and Dam. The area behind me with all the trees is known as Westrick Park, and eagles like to use it as a winter migration roost site. So it, we commonly see 40, 50, 60 eagles here in the winter. Um, they come here and they use the Columbia River as a lunch buffet. It's uh, <laughs> They come here in search of food every year. Their main diet is fish, and in the winter here on the Columbia, they are mainly eating shad. But they will eat other waterfowl, so they hunt other birds. They will eat carrion, so anything dead, they're opportunistic, they're scavengers. So what is unique about raptors, the word raptor means to seize and carry. Bald eagles, that's exactly what they do. <laughs> they have very sharp talons, which acts as a knife that they can capture their prey. You can see their talons as very bumpy here, spicules. So it means those slippery fish can't slip out of their talons very easily. They have really great vision, about four to six times better vision than ours. And they have binocular vision, which means that each eye operates independently of each other. So they can, as they're flying, watch out where they're going with one eye while zooming in on a fish with another eye. So they can see fish from about a mile and a half away. That's pretty cool. Eagles are resident all over North America. So they range from Canada and um, all the way down to Mexico. So we do have year round residents and it's just more common that you'll see large numbers in the winter because they've all migrated to areas where there's more food. Winter wildlife watching is a good thing to go do um, at any park, especially in the Columbia River Gorge. You know, there's lots of trails you can visit. Here in the Dalles, here at Super Park is one of them because you're a safe distance. You want to stay at least 300 yards away from eagles. You know, in the winter, it's all about survival for these birds. It's important for, to have good eagle etiquette. And um, when you're out there, keep your dog on a leash. You know, our dogs and animals are curious, so they wander off. And if there's animals that are nesting on the ground or eating, you know, eagles find stuff to eat on the ground. You know, the anim our animals can disturb them and they fly off. And that could mean, um, birds are using calories up that they might need to survive that night. You know, on a cold night, that could mean that's survival for them. So keep your dog on a leash is good eagle etiquette, maintaining a safe distance of 300 yards. But you know, if you bring a spotting scope and your binoculars, that's easy to do. It's easy to keep your distance or you stay in your car and watch them.